I have with me now Mr. Ahmad Al Shamsi, CEO of Abu Dhabi Sewerage Services Company. Mr. Ahmad, welcome to this interview. Thank you. Pleasure to be here. What actions can be taken now to ensure the world doesn't face a global water crisis in the future? This is a very good question. I think uh, responsibility goes to everyone, starting from the policy makers, companies, and the end users. The uh, policy makers should really incentivize uh, the use of uh, recycled or renewed water compared, the, compared to the uh, reserved uh, water resources. Companies should come with state-of-the-art technologies that will help uh, incentivize the quality level of the recycled water. When it comes to the young generation, uh, they need really to understand uh, the benefits around recycled uh, water from uh, the, waste, uh, the wastewater resources. It's very crucial to consider that the recycled water is in bar with uh, the fresh water. Mm -hmm. How can water quality and water treatment be improved? We need to adopt uh, the best in-class technologies, uh, rely heavily on innovation. Uh, we need to ensure that we have state-of-the-art network uh, of our uh, recycled uh, water. Uh, moving from uh, restricted uh, crops to unrestricted safe use of uh, recycled water. This is very important. Can water desalination, especially we have it here in uh, UAE, can water desalination be a solution to water uh, security? Yes, indeed. UAE is considered one of the top 10 countries globally uh, having desalinated, desalinated water reserves. Uh, however, there are some challenges of uh, uh, using or adopting the RO, the RO technologies and it's very much linked to uh, the cost uh, structure of this kind of industry and we need to make it more efficient, uh, more affordable to expand the usage of uh, RO technology.